Oh, I've got like the radio DJ voice going too. Uh, uh, oh. Hey Kern County, Megan Pearson, your Director of Countywide Communications with this week's Around the County. Today we're actually in front of the county's TV station. Uh, so the equipment that you see and you might even hear behind me is what it takes to actually run a county government TV station. If you're interested in watching, the channels are 16 on Spectrum, 99 on AT&T, and 18 on Charter Cable. Channel 16 on Mediacom, and if you're really interested, we stream NASA TV at night. So each day adds a different set of uh, programming. It's really interesting. You can find out what's going on around county government and we hope you watch. First of all, we want to welcome HGTV and their crew to Kern County. Uh, they started a few days ago working on building a house here. They've been working with our film commission and our Department of Planning and Natural Resources for months to select a location. We're very happy that they came to Kern County. More importantly, we're really, really honored by all of the work that the volunteers, our residents, the businesses, and the organizations all have come together to uh, put, put on and in seven days they've built a house and so hopefully you'll see that soon. Next up, it's all about social media. Here in Kern County, we're pretty big on using social media and the Shafter um, Learning Center is actually hosting a social media training on Tuesday, September 3rd from 5.30 to 8 p.m. Just so you know, this training, the last time they did it, it filled up right away. So if you're interested, if your organization, your business is trying to get into the social media space, we strongly encourage you to take advantage of this service. It's a, a great opportunity to learn uh, what's available to you and how to use it to your best advantage. Um, if you want more information, you can email info at kerncitizensforenergy.com. Next up, the Kern County Hispanic Chamber of Commerce is hosting the Hispanic Business Conference. It's the 25th annual conference. It's on Thursday, August 29th from 1 to 7 p.m. at the Marriott on Truxton. It's a great opportunity for breakout sessions and uh, presentations and a keynote speaker. They actually have the gentleman who is the creator behind the Flamin' Hot Cheetos. So uh, go check that out. If you want more information, you can visit the website for the Kern County Hispanic Chamber of Commerce. Our next event is out in Rosemont. It's a charity event called On Grid for Charity 2019. It's at the Speedway out there, the Speedway at Willow Springs. It's on Saturday, August 31st from 5 p.m. on, and they'll have a concert, they'll have the cars out, all sorts of stuff for the community to take part in. We hope you'll participate. If you want more information, you can visit the Speedway at willowsprings.com. Our last event is up in Tehachapi, and I'm kind of excited about this, it's kind of funny. It's a, a goat yoga and wine at the Dorner Family Vineyard on August 31st at 6 p.m. It is 21 and older because they are serving wine because it's goat yoga and wine. So again, we hope you get out and check it out. If you're looking for more information, again, that's californiagoatyoga.com and we'll see you there. Last up, we wanna thank our folks in Sacramento who met with us yesterday, all about economic development and the future for Kern County and all of our cities. Uh, so first we wanna thank the Governor's Office of Business and Economic Development we want to thank Senator Shanna Grove and Senator Melissa Hurtado. We also want to thank Assemblyman Rudy Salas and Assemblyman Vince Fong. Uh, you carved out some time for us and we really appreciate it. There's exciting things coming to Kern County and that's this week around the county. We'll see you next week.